So, do you know anything about either of these these photographs, Harold? Well, this is all Soviet fetcher. Our American legions know named after him. Oh, okay. A post up there is called Mm -hmm. He was in, uh, well, he's quite a soldier, 28th Division. He was in World War I. Wow. Actually, he got killed in World War I. Okay. He was a lieutenant colonel, mm -hmm. cavalry, rode them horses, you know, in them days. Uh, I think he was killed in France. Mm -hmm. That might be a picture of his his grave cross. Huh? I think that might be a picture of that man's grave. Yeah. That cross. Mm -hmm. yeah, see, I forget where his grave is. I think it was on a cemetery out here. Okay. On the hill by uh, Snake mm -hmm. mm -hmm. okay. I never knew the guy. I never met him. Um. I understand they were probably around second cousins. Okay. And I had a different story, I had a kilt, you know. I, I heard he was out with his cavalry one time on horses, you know. Mm -hmm. And they run into the machine gun nest. Okay, Ooh. And on horses, you don't turn around and go back, you have to charge. You know? mm -hmm. So that's what he did, he moved him out. Mm -hmm. Wow. And he was the highest ranking officer killed from the state of Pennsylvania. Wow. For World War I. Mm -hmm. Um, is there anything else that you would like to share with us about Milton or anything or about these items? Oh, not very much. You know, the old town. You know, way back to it over here, it was burnt down one time. Oh, wow. I forget when that was. That started at the ACNF, you know, this is called the ACNF. Okay. Oh, over half the town burnt. Wow. But they built it back up again. Wow. And I think one of the biggest things is when Chef Boardy moved in. Oh. It was down there. Yeah, I think I heard about that, that Chef yeah. Boyardi came from here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he made stuff for the army. <laughs> they used to grow a lot of tomatoes around him. Oh, okay. For him. Yeah. That's our first two cut. Praise we have here every year mm -hmm. was called a tomato festival. Oh, the tomato festival. But then he quit, uh, uh, he started getting tomato juice, just the juice from California. Mm -hmm. So I cut that out, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the farmers used to go with a lot of tomatoes around here. Wow. Picking $10 a bushel, uh, 10 cents a bushel. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I worked at Fox and Apple, it was called a shirt factory. Okay. They made army stuff to go D shirts. Mm -hmm. 